G'day, welcome to Mount Cranberry Apiculture. Just wanted to have a chat about these alcohol wash bottles. Under the new biosecurity code of practice, you need to do an alcohol wash every um, 16 weeks or every four months. Um, up to 64 hives, you need to do all your hives. Um, 64 and over, you need to do um, at least 64. So um, if you've got 200 hives, you just need to do 64 out of those 200. Um, if you've got more than 640 hives, you just need to do 10%. So you can read about it in the um, biosecurity code of practice. I'll just go through how these work. So it's just basically two bottles with a screen in the middle. So hook one bottle up, a bit of metho in the other one. So don't get too worried about how much. Half a cup, three quarters of a cup of metho. And just screw that back up and you're ready to go. These are pretty robust. Um, when you screw them up, try and hold them by the middle rather than screw both the ends because you can twist it off, but they're, they're pretty robust. So all you need is your wash bottle, your metho, and some sort of a bucket or a tub to collect the bees in. So we'll go and do that now. So we're at our hive that we want to wash, check for mites. First thing to do is go through and, and um, locate your queen. You don't really want her to go in because it will kill her. So look methodically through your frames and locate that queen. So there's our queen there. Let's walk around that frame. That's so what I do. Sit her outside so she doesn't go in the wash. Get my bottle ready. Grab my bucket and shake some nurse bees in there. So it's important you're getting nurse bees rather than field bees because they're more likely to have mites on them because of their proximity to the to the brood. So got our bees, there's plenty there. You won't need that many. So just get them into the corner of the tub and into the bottle. Take the remnants back in there. Get the shaker back on. 
you need to shake that quite vigorously for four minutes. Not, not like that, like I've seen done, just a really good hard shake. So the idea is to um, dislodge the dead mites off the bees. Let's get that nice and tight so it doesn't leak. So that's a four minute shake. So there's our four minute shaking done. So all you need to do now is turn that upside down. And in theory, any mites that were on those bees would be, be dislodged. you will be able to see them in the bottom of that liquid there. Small reddish brown mites. Um, the larger ones are about the size of a sesame seed. So you can look up there, hold them to the light and if they're present, you'll see them. Uh, there's nothing, nothing in that apart from a few flecks of, um, of pollen. So that's it. So that's your alcohol varroa wash. Just remember, you need to do one every 16 weeks in New South Wales now. I have these for sale. Just go to my website, araravalleyhoney.com.au and go to the store um, tab at the top where, where my honey is and you'll see these listed in the shop. So, so um, yeah, alcohol, barawa, wash bottles.